Well, I'm coming up here to the local store. Why don't you look at parking lot? Little bitty store. It is packed. I thought, oh my lord, I hope all these people are up here getting groceries and stuff. Evidently, I got something going on across the school over there. I was about to have a panic attack. I need some baby wipes. Later. Well, I got up to cook some chicken. Freezer burn. All the way around. I got that at the family dollar store. I don't think I'll be cooking that. All right, we'll talk to y'all later. Almost messed up. Look, see that trailer number? Look at this trailer number. They both got eight in it, and when you're backing up, they both have 48. One's 348, and the other one's 248. So I had to swap trailers. Just make sure you check your trailer, double check. All right, catch up with y'all later. Like had a bad, uh-oh. <laughs> well, good morning, drivers. You seen I had to swap the trailers because I had the wrong number, but uh, everything's good to go now. Uh, main thing I just want to talk about this morning is safety for truck drivers through this stuff. Uh, clean the toilets, clean the sinks, no brushing your teeth inside. Uh, no shaving inside. Stay stay out of the truck stops doing that shaving, brushing your teeth, and all that stuff inside because that's where the germs are. You know the ones I'm talking about. And some people even are washing their feet in the sink. But uh, just stay clear of all that stuff. Uh, get you a bucket and whatever, wash your feet, brush your teeth. Uh, as you notice, I still haven't got a haircut. Um, I can't even find a brush or a comb this morning. Oh, well. Put a hat on and let her roll, should I say. But, uh, everybody be safe. Uh, just get your food to go. Don't be lounging around buffets or, you know, order you off the grill and stuff. And drivers, be safe, uh, during this time. And safety rules for the laws of exemption. There's a lot of controversy going on around here. If you are hauling supplies, I'm watching this ELD, which takes 30 minutes when you mash a button, they'll give you a response back on just to review your logs. Um... They are pulling us in and checking log books um, or your ELDs and they want to see you manifest or you build a lady. Uh, and I think you're supposed to have a letter also states that you're under the FMCSA exemption for that load uh, from the um, shipper and receivers whoever's shipping it um I think I think was what I was told and I was 100% sure because my uh dispatcher he's 99% of the time he's right when I ask these questions um so if you get pulled in and you just have a regular manifest or whatever uh you better make sure your logbook is correct your EFD is on regular standard time 14 hours 11 hours driving your eight hour break and all that good stuff because i heard they was gonna find pretty steep if you're messing with uh 
the rules of exemption, should I say. Um, that's all I got right this minute. Well, drivers, be safe. Welcome to the Buttermilk channel. Uh, hope you all like some of these crazy videos I do. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to just drop me a line. Uh, and I figured out why I couldn't leave comments now. Uh, so, that should be fixed. Um, so, everybody have a good day. We'll catch up with you later. Everybody be safe.